strange technical terms like de-risking. You know? So mm -hmm. I, I thought I was an educated person. I studied physics a lot, and de-risking never came up. Um, and so the program really helped me get to a point where I was a lot more conversant with the people who can help me out. And then most importantly, the mentors with whom I was working were excellent. The advice that I got, the direction that I got, uh, how it focused my thinking was really, really great. Um, it was interesting because there was a meeting of the minds with the, a number of them where people thought like I did. They had just happened to go through different you know, trainings. So some of them were in business, uh, some of them were in uh, different parts of sustainability analysis. But we, we once we got over the, the lingo, uh, there was a real clear, uh, a process of identifying clearly what's the problem, what do we need to do, and then figuring out the right way of thinking about it to get to the right solution. And the people with whom I was partnered were excellent. I want to keep them in my orbit. And through this process, I met so many people beyond just the mentors. And one plug for the Northeast is that this is where you will find the best people in this. Um, I had the privilege of going to Los Angeles to pitch this and the Tech Open Global Forum. Um, and the people who were there were very good, some big name uh, people in the entrepreneur, entrepreneurial world. But it was not as impressive as the group that I have met here. So whether it's legal advice, technical advice, uh, business advice, uh, uh, pretty much you name it, uh, this is where I found the best people were. Um, and so uh, this is really the hub uh, of this kind of technology. And so if you're thinking about building a company, it seems like this is the place to be. And this is the place where investors seem to be looking for these opportunities, the new ideas coming out. Um, I'll just stop there and see if there are any questions.